Thirty years had passed. Decades without rain. The once fertile plains of Fars had become as barren as the loot salt desert. A few arrow shots from Persepolis. The Kushans, bloodthirsty warriors from the east, were attacking Persia. Persian soldiers defended the land, no matter the cost. Ardashir resisted heroically, but his men fell one by one. Anahita summoned her remaining strength in battle. For Yuvishka, the Kushan general, victory was certain. Until history took a different turn. The seven immortals were the best warriors in the kingdom. One of them would become a legend. Onward, immortals! Anahita! Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Save Persepolis. I trained you for this. I will go help my wounded warriors. Let's go, Sargon. Eliminate those Kushan archers. Leave it to me! How many did you get? I'll get out of your way, so you can catch up! Yeah! <laughs> 
immortals! Don't let them get to General Luis! Watch out, Saga! That general must not be far. Let me handle him. Take this. You might need it. Yviska, you can't hide from me. The Russia bar, was it? <laughs> Your life ends here. Not if yours ends first. The mighty Simurg, protector of Persia, has long left. But should our enemies try to take advantage of the situation, they will soon find that the kingdom's bravest warriors will be their undoing. Thirty years ago, the divine bird Simurg graced my shoulder thus showing his trust in me to guide our people. Today, I, Tomiris, Queen of Persia, praise your valor and loyalty, immortals. Varun, you and your forces have once again saved the kingdom. Hassan, Prince of Persia! Step forward, Sargon. Word of your deeds precedes you through the streets of Persepolis. Accept this royal sash as a token of our gratitude. Sargon, the Rashabar, the black wind that destroys all in his path. I didn't choose that name. You need not worry. I do not attach any importance to these superstitions. The winds also carry the seeds of future harvests. I am truly glad to meet you, Sargon. Thank you, Prince Hassan. Let us drop the honorifics. 
And may we get to know each other in less formal circumstances. As you wish, Hassan. We owe this victory to you, Rajabar. I am glad you're on our side. Just watch out. The Rashabar is said to sow ruin and destruction. I do not believe such stories. I've seen your contribution in battle. That is all that matters to me. Long live the House of Tiberis! Your name brings hope to Persia and is feared by the enemy. What a reputation. Maybe. I didn't ask to be prince either, but fate has spoken and I must accept it. Varum, we're somehow the only immortals left here. <laughs> the others are probably letting loose up on the roof. Not all warriors belong in the throne room. Join them, Sargon. I'll be along soon enough. I'm proud of you, Sargon. I defeated Yuvishka, and we saved Persepolis. Did we? Thousands died on the battlefield. We're out of supplies. Persia is barely surviving. The Kashan will surely come back. Would you call that a victory? I... let my pride go to my head. A warrior's journey is always one in progress, and when there's nothing left in one's path, the warrior wanders. What is at the end of my blade? I know. Found an answer yet? I won't figure that out tonight. Maybe a drink will help. You should join us. Thanks. But I have other matters to attend to. You have what it takes to become one of the greatest, Sargon. I know. Just watch me. Oh. And listen to Varum. He will keep you on the right path. I'm telling you, Prince Hassan may be my son! <laughs> oh, that's nonsense. He looks nothing like you. He took everything from his mom, that's all! <laughs> <laughs> all right, you are really not her type. Whose type? Ah, the kid finally decided to join us. The hero of the day. <laughs> the Queen's new protege. So... You're mingling with aristocracy now. Or trading in your swords to become a satrap. Laugh all you want. Who eliminated a general tonight, huh? Don't encourage them, Sargon. It just means you've impressed them. Yeah, he's right. You were impressive. If you want to talk more quietly, I won't be far. Was Varum still with you? Yeah. He's in the throne room. So there. Must be collecting our payment. What payment? Artaban gets paid in strolls. I can hear you, man Elias. Not bad, kid. Not bad. What do you mean, not bad? <laughs> Keep it up, and maybe one day you'll take on a real challenge like me. Ugh, you just don't want to get your ass kicked in front of an audience. <laughs> Keep dreaming, kid. Go see Nate. She's waiting for you. So, will you still remember us now that you're famous? <laughs> I'm trying to stay humble. And find what is at the end of my blade. Oh, sounds like Anahita set your head straight. Um, sort of. In her own way. You know, it is amazing what you did. You should be proud of yourself. We all One of our own eliminated the Kashan General. Outstanding. And you are the White Lion's pride. You ragtag bunch of immortals. <laughs> you have always been destined for greatness. 
And with Sargon's bravery, that's another one for the history books. We made the city safe. The people are at peace again. This is cute, but can we go celebrate now? Our usual haunts has food and drinks on the house. Varum, you're coming with us. I wouldn't miss it. Varum! Prince Hassan has been kidnapped. Kidnappers? They must still be in the palace. Take the lead, Sargon. You may be the last to have spoken to him. We must find Prince Hassan. And I hate his guards. Anahita, what is this all about? I wasn't planning on killing you, Sargon. Stay out of this. Move out of my way. What the hell was that? Ah, uh, still a child. Sargon, who was it? I thought I recognized Anahita. Is she involved? Yes, she is. Without a doubt. Barum, gather your forces. You are to leave for Mount Kaf at once in search of Prince Hassan. Ardashir and his soldiers are already on the way. We need all the help we can get. We will not fail you, Your Majesty. Bring him back. Bring back my son. <laughs> Citadel. Anahita took Prince Hassan beyond these gates. I can't fathom why Anahita would do such a thing. Sargon, you know her best. What do you make of it? It doesn't make sense. She has always been loyal. She wants to seize power for herself. Oh, what do you even mean? 
The Simorg may have disappeared, but the mighty god used to live on Mount Karf, and perhaps still does. It has always been the Simorg who appoints future kings and queens. Hmm. Anahita probably wishes to receive the Simorg's blessing. But why kidnap Prince Hassan? She needs him. The gates to the Simorg temple only open for members of the royal family. She has lost her mind. She will never get the Simorg's blessing like that. We can't be certain. After all, the Simorg may be weakened. One thing's for sure. Prince Hassan is in danger. She will kill him once she has no need for him. Immortals, follow me. Let's help Ardashir and find Prince Hassan. <laughs> Wait for me here. Don't worry. I won't be long. of mountains. Been here before? No, but I've read about it. This place was once the site of King Darius's palace. Religion, medicine, astrology, geometry, algebra. All knowledge was gathered here, accessible to all. Mount Kaf was home to a great citadel of wisdom, the pride of all Persia. And? What happened? No one survived to tell the tale. And to think that Prince Hassan is caught up in all this. Who knows what might await us? What is this sorcery? I'm a warrior, not a seer. Frozen as it falls. As if time had stopped. Stay sharp. Prince Hassan can't be far now. Something is not right here. We must proceed with caution. Sure, man Elias. You can scurry from shadow to shadow like frightened vermin. I'm serious, Orod. There's a strange presence here. I can feel it too. There's only one way to find out. <laughs> ah, let's go then. Baram, this is Azad, one of Ardashir's men. Long dead, judging by the rot. How is that possible? They left not long before us. We are not welcome here. Stay on your guard. We will find the Prince and Anahita. We go east. We don't go anywhere. You'll only slow me down. 
You're on your own.
are you doing here? This place is too dangerous for a child. Don't worry about me. I know the Citadel better than anyone. I know every step. I even go where others can't. I've chatted and argued with every creature. And I know every tree here. Like this one? Are they all like this? These trees are special. They're called Wack Wack. They have the purest of Athra. So, stand beneath its leaves to restore your energy. There are many Wack Wack trees throughout Mount Calf. Tell me, you say you know all here. We're in search of soldiers like us. Our prince is being led by an... a general. Have you seen anyone like that? A prince? There hasn't been a prince here in so long. I've only seen you. Well, if you've lost your friend in Mount Calf, then you're going to need an Eye of the Wanderer. What's that? It's a very rare, very ancient thing. Here, for you. Go on, try it. I might as well show you a neat trick to remember places on Mount Calf. Thank you, miss. I don't know your name. My name is Faraba. I'm Sargon, warrior of the Immortals. Oh, doesn't that sound impressive? Well, Sargon, I'm sure we'll meet again in Mount Calf. I'll share my discoveries with you when I can, but I'll need time crystals to do it. Time crystals? <laughs> Welcome to Mount Calf. Yeah. 
Sargon, up here! Take the prince to the Simor Gate. Anahita! Don't you dare harm him! If you want Prince Hassan back, come and get him! Anahita! Anahita was here. She's taking Hassan to the Simor Gate. Then Artaban may be right about her wanting the throne. That thing above us. What is it? I'm not sure. But to get to Hassan and Anahita, we must destroy it. From this distance, that's not possible for either of us. Maybe Menelaus can help here. Varum sent him to the east to investigate the forest. I'll try to find him. I'll look for another way. brings you here, traveler? My allies and I are in pursuit of a traitor. Then you and the others are trapped here, too. Mount Calf has seen its share of travelers. Many are lost within the web of time's curse. Beware, warrior. Death and misery roam the citadel. I've seen my share of death. Even the most determined of warriors must be prepared. Take this. Its unique properties will aid you. Just know that each one is precious and can only be changed at a whack whack tree. I'll make good use of this. Welcome. Welcome. Artaban. Sargon. Varum saw Anahita's guards, and he's in pursuit. As for me, I cannot continue. Time flows differently here. My mind is playing tricks on me. I can't discern the truth from the imaginary. Artaban, thank you for being honest with me. Does this mean you're retreating? I'm not giving in just yet. I intend to serve until my last breath. After all, if Anahita really has changed loyalties, I believe you're short of a sparring partner. Let's warm up and review the basics. The basics, again? Practice doesn't make perfect. Perfect practice makes perfect. Get in position. Show me how you chain ground attacks.
very well. Bear in mind you can redirect your next attack. Since you propel your opponent away with your last strike, that's the end of the chain. At close range, the sweep is good against smaller foes. You can also chain attacks afterwards. An airborne enemy cannot retaliate until they're back on their feet. Make use of that. Perfect to cripple agile enemies. Remember that you move forward with each attack. If you want to keep your distance, the sweep allows you to maintain your position. This doesn't suit your style, but some situations might require you to take such precautions. Precautions? What precautions? Hmm, my point exactly. A few moments later. Fine work. You now know all the basics. Don't forget, you can always visit for a training session. If you learn new moves, Perhaps we can figure out together how to use them. Take this for starters. Good to see you. Welcome.
another one of Ardashir's men. Sargon! How? You're alive. So much time has passed. What? You only got here last night. One single night that has lasted 30 years. 30 years? This place is a prison. There is no way out. You must flee. Where are your brothers in arms? All lost in the Citadel. All prisoners of time. This is no end for a warrior. This endless captivity. If a soldier is to die, it should be in combat. My insignia. Take my brothers in arms will give theirs too. When the time comes to release them. <laughs> Wait, who are you? You just disappeared.
Hello. Is it the first time you're meeting a whack whack tree? I've seen these trees along my journey, but you're the first to speak. <laughs> no, no. I'm not a whack whack tree. I live in it. There are many whack whack trees across the citadel. Their branches are a refuge for us, and also a great help for travelers like you. Yes, I've noticed. These trees have always been here, since the start of all life. Their roots are deep, nourished by the primordial Athra that res- But now, the forest suffers. Amidst the curse, a creature from elsewhere sows more misfortune and desolation. Here, take this. You'll need it. Grisly fate. The armor looks old and tattered.
and Elias' boat. What's going on? Menelaus isn't with you. We got separated. Why? It's strange. I encountered another version of myself. A warrior who looked just like me. <laughs> what are you talking about? You are not welcome here. What was that? What? Some beast too scared to even show itself. That's what. Now where did it go? I want myself a real fight. Good luck to you, Sargon. Try not to go mad! Mm -hmm. 